Okay, taking a look here tonight. Uh, you can see I've got uh, a cell with two pair of electrodes in it. Uh, these are the large electrodes. They're actually uh, 6.8 millimeters in diameter, uh, about 110 millimeters long. Uh, and the SEC 15.3 uh, is the modified SEC 15.3 that I was uh, I told you about in the last videos. Uh, and this is being powered by a single 12 volt cell. Um, so I'm now only using 12 volts uh, power supply and you can see that there's uh, some pretty vigorous uh, evolution of gas from the electrodes. Uh, actually both of them. So it won't be real long uh, that I'll be moving to uh, actually making some measurements here uh, real shortly. Now we got a little flicker in there in the video. Uh, I don't know whether the, the exciter's fooling with the throwing some interference in or not. Um, but this has very similar, uh, actually, it's not quite so clear to see on the surface, but the uh, the hydrogen coming off of these two cathodes, uh, you can actually see that there's uh, there's four electrodes in this in this cell. Uh, the anodes are just about one in behind each other, but you can see that uh, that second anode just to the left of the one front center, uh, which is bubbling just a little bit, and then on either side are are cathodes uh, that are just rolling waves. Of Tiny little, uh, tiny little bubbles of hydrogen off, uh, and they're they're forming a foam on the top of the of the cell of the electrolyte, uh, and you can see similar uh, similar action to uh, what I was showing last night. So we're definitely rolling, um, and it's starting to look good here. We're, we'll get uh, hopefully I get to the point. I'm gonna well, I'm gonna make some measurements of uh, of gas. The, the gas evolving off of here for power over power in, and then, uh, then eventually I'm going to try to wake this up uh, and, and see if I can sustain a flame. So uh, uh, from the from the Yankee Laboratories up here in uh, in the Northland, we're hopefully going to be making some heat soon. Uh, thanks for watching.